What's going on YouTube? My name is Jeans, back with some single battles for Pokemon Sword. Before this video even starts, you guys know the deal. Show some support by smashing that like button, clicking that subscribe button, and let me know in the comment section down below. Seriously, thank you to everybody who has subscribed, liked the videos, and just tuned in to watch. So guys, in today's video, we're rocking out with this Flygon singles team. Dude, I'm hyped to use it because I never really use Flygon in competitive battles. Only use them in like the wild area and all that good stuff. But rocking in the front spot, we got this Twist Scarf, Darmanitan, rocking U-Turn, Iso Crash, Flare Blitz, and EQ. I'm actually hyped to use him because he's such a beast. Very fast, and he hits like a truck. Then we got Toxtricity, rocking out Assault Vest so we can soak up some special attacks. Rocking Nuzzle to put on the Paralyze. Boom Burst, do some damage. Same thing with Sludge Wave and Overdrive. Then we got my boy Scrafty. I love using Scrafty. He's just such a good Pokemon in Pokemon. That's kind of it's kind of funny. Good Pokemon and Pokemon, but it's all right. He's rocking Leftovers, Bulk Up, Foul Play, Drain Punch, and Rest, which is nice with this ability of Shed Skin. Then we got a beast, a defensive beast of Corviknight right here with Pressure and Rocky Helmet. Rocky Helmet, as he takes hits, will deal damage out. Rocking Brave Bird, Body Press, Roost to heal up, and the Fog. Then we got my boy Pex right here, Toxic Pex, rocking Scald, Recover, Toxic, and Haze. A normal move set for him with Black Sludge, like always, but he's rocking Limber as his ability. I would rather have regenerate so he can regenerate some health when he swaps out, but Limber's fine. He cannot get paralyzed with that ability. Then, the Pokemon I'm most excited for. Wait a minute, guys. New Pokemon alert. Let's get it, dude. Flygon is hopping in here with Earth Power, Draco Meteor, Flamethrower, and U-Turn, and he has Choice Specs with Levitate as his ability. But, guys, if you'd like to use this team for yourselves, rental code is at the bottom of the screen. Definitely check it out. This team, I haven't used it yet, but we're going to be trying it out here. I can't wait to show it off. Also, guys, let me know for question of the day. What games are you guys most excited for? Because I'm very excited for that new Animal Crossing to come out. Like, let's go. I'm going to be doing a lot of work on the channel with it. But, guys, let's hop in these battles. What kind of Pokemon is this guy rocking? He's rocking that Gyarados, Dragapult, Quagsire, Rotomo, Lucario, and that Mimikyu. And that Mimikyu. Okay. Okay. I see this guy. I see him. He has a very physical attack team. So, dude, Pex can come in here. Same thing with Corviknight. Should we roll out with Corviknight and that Pex? That could be nice. We go Pex, Corviknight, and we can go with that Flygon in the back end. Or do we want to roll out with Pex, Scrafty, and Flygon? I definitely want to roll in with Pex and Flygon. I definitely want to get both of them. Some loving in this match. Hmm. Does he have any flying types? That's the question. Any flying types? No. But I think that Lucario would be super effective to my Scrafty. But I'm going to be leading out with that Tuck Spec. Let's go Pex into that Scrafty. And that Flygon rocket in that back end. So we get rolling out hard in this beginning part. Let's go. Let's go. Who's this guy rocking? Who's he going to start off with? But guys, if you'd like to catch more content from me, make sure you head in the link in the description below. Gene25 on Twitch. Seriously, stream four plus days every single week. It is tons of fun. Again, new season is out. We're trying to push Master Ball tier. So, hope to see you guys there. Well, what are you going to pick? I see him probably leading that Rotom Mo, which, hmm. We could always, hmm, that's tough. He leads that Mo. If he leads that Mo, which I think he's going to lead, because that would be the smart play, because if I go into my Corviknight or my Pex, he should have the Mo on his team. Is he going to bring that Quagsire? He might bring that Quagsire, but I see him bringing that Dragapult, the Mo, and that Mimikyu or Lucario. One of those two, but definitely the Dragapult and that Mo should be coming in here, which I'm fine with. I'm fine with. I'm going to be rocking out here, getting this victory with this team right here. Let's get it, guys. Let's get it. What you want? What you want? What you want, man? Yeah. We're going to beat you up, man. We're going to get this win. Yeah. There we go. Gyarados in that front spot, which I'm fine with. We're just going to get a free Toxic off here, I think. I think we're just going to get a free Toxic off. Let's see what this thing is going to do. He might D-Dance, but he's going to intimidate us, which is fine. Which is fine. I'm not too worried. We're just here to stall out, do some work. Let's go with this Toxic. If he wants to roll out with a Haze, or what's it called? A D-Dance this turn. Let's see. Taunt's going to come in here. Wow, dude. Smart little cookie here. Smart little cookie's going to roll in with the Taunt. We're going to fall for the Taunt. That's fine. We cannot throw a Toxic off. Now we're just going to go into a... Uh, can we go for that Burn here? We could go for that Burn. Let him D-Dance up or something. I don't mind if he D-dances. Let's go. Thunder Wave. We got Limber on us. We have Limber. You cannot paralyze this. Get out my face. Just as I was saying, I would rather have a generator on Lim Limber. comes up clutch, which is nice, which is nice. Can we get that burn? Nope, no burn. We're going to go for that burn once again here. Trying to rock out. Let's see. Let's see. Come on. Show it to me. Give me that burn. Are you going to swap out? What are you going to do? I was going to read that D-dance. No, he's going to swap out, which is nice. I was going to read that D-dance, which is fine. He's going to get that free swap. Go into that Mo. Okay, like I said, the Mo is here. Skull's gonna come in here. Show me that burn. Give me that burn on him. Give me that burn. He's gonna go for a thunder move here. We're gonna sh shake off the taunt. I can see us eating up a shot. Unless he Dynamaxes. Hmm. Could swap out. Try to get this toxic. That would be huge. Um. Hmm. Who do we roll into? We roll into this Choice Scarf Flygon. And we are part ground type. 
So I don't know if we could take electric moves. We'll see. We'll see in just a second. Let's go. Peck's gonna come back here. We're gonna roll out into this Flygon. Let's see. Let's see how this works out here. She's gonna go for a discharge, which is fine by us. Does not affect us because we are part ground. Now we're gonna rock out. Do we uh should we scarf the flamethrower? Or how do we go in here? How do we roll out here? I can see him potentially maybe staying in. He could go back into that uh what's it called? He could go back into that flygon, which I'm fine with. I'm gonna choose scarf on the flamethrower. I'm gonna choose scarf on the flamethrower right here, right now. I can see him hard swap back into the what's it called? The Gyarados, which is fine by me. I might just dine after that. Or just go into my what's it called? Go into my pecs. There goes the swap. That's fine. She's gonna go back into that Gyarados. I believe so. I believe so. Let's see. Gyarados is gonna pop back out here. And we're gonna get off this flamethrower. We might go into a dine here. We might go into a dine here. To try to get things rolling. But this thing could be rolling out with a dragon move. Let's see. Let's see. Here we go. Bang. Flamethrower. Show me that burn or something. Show me that burn. Come on. Give it to me. Nope. No burn. Um, we're gonna make a hard swap in here to our our pecs. Back to our pecs. We might try to go for that taunt on our pecs. We might get a free scald. Let's see. What are we gonna do? I said we just die in here. I said we just die in a we go after him hard. Is that the call? Is that the call? Go after him hard here? I really want to go into my pecs here. I do want to go into my pecs if he goes into a, what's it called, a Dynamax later. We're just going to swap into our pecs. Hopefully he goes for a T-Wave and we can set off that Limber again, get a free swap. Let's see what happens. We're going right back into our pecs. We're going to show this guy. We're here to stay. We're here to stay. We're here to battle it out. Let's go. What are you going to go for? T-Wave, let's go. We get that free swap in here. And we're going to go for that poison. He's probably going to go for a taunt in here. I can see him going for a taunt, so might as well just go for a skull, try to get that burn. Just play it slow. Just play it slow. Let him go with that taunt. I see that coming. Here goes the taunt. That's fine by me. We're going for a skull anyway. We're not even going for that toxic. We're not even going for that toxic. Let's go. Skull's coming out here. We're just going to do a little bit of damage. Try to get this burn off once again. Come on, show it to me. Show it to me. Let's go. There we go. Got that burn off. I'm fine by it. I am fine with it. Uh, what are we going to do here? Are we going to uh, read this hard swap here? I can see him totally hard swapping. I can see him hard swapping, but I'm just gonna go for another skull. I can see him going back into that Mo. Again, it's fine by me. He's gonna go into a Hydro Pump. Dude, we eat that up. No problem. We'll eat that up. No problem. Give me that. Give me that. Tasty. That was tasty, dude. That was beautiful. That was really delicious snack right there. That Hydro Pump was a delicious snack, but the burn's gonna start teeing off here. I can see him hard swapping, so we're gonna hard swap just the same here. We're gonna hard swap just the same here. We're gonna try to follow him up here. Or do we go for that toxic? Are we still in the taunt? Let me see if we are still in the taunt. Let's see. Are we taunted? We are still taunted for one turn. Um. Now nah, we're just gonna roll up with another skull. We're gonna play this one slow. We're gonna play this one slow because we have to right now. We have to play it slow. Here goes the withdrawal. I knew he was gonna withdraw. Like I said, I should have hard swapped into my flygon right here. Would have been beautiful. I saw that coming. I saw it coming. But skull's gonna pop out here. Um, I can see him reading that we're gonna swap into the flygon and not go for the what's it called? What's going on? I think he's thinking that we're going to swap into the Flygon, so we might go for a Leaf move. We're going to go straight for this Toxic here and try to put it on him. We're going to go straight for his Toxic. I don't think he's going to go for an, an Electric move here, thinking that we're going to swap into the Flygon. So let's see. Let's see if I make the right call again. Let's make this read and make it happen. Let's get it, guys. Let's go. Well, watch this. He's not going to go for that Electric move. I know. He's not going to go for that Electric move. He's not doing it. He's not doing it. He's like, he's just going to swap back into his flag. i to waste my turn. Look at this. Oh, dude. Lucky biscuit. Lucky biscuit. No. Wow, dude. Bad play by me. Nope. I tried. I tried. It's okay. Um, We're going to roll out into our, uh, our flag on here. Just roll out into our flag on here. No big deal. We'll go after that. What's it called? Do we go straight into the what's it called? The Dynamax here? We could go straight into that Dynamax. Set off a Max Flare. We could do that. We could go straight into that Dynamax here. Start doing some work. Hmm. Hmm. We have that Scrafty in the back. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, let's go into this Dynamax. Let's set the Drought off here. Let's go right into this Dynamax here. He's going to withdraw. That's fine by me. And we're going to set off this uh, Drought here so we can stay in with this uh, Gyarados. Which is fine. He's burned. We're going to do a little bit of damage to him. He's shiny. I knew I should have went for like the uh, a different move here. But we're chilling. Intimidate's going to pop out here. It's okay. We are special attacking. And we are truly specced on this thing. Which is beautiful. We are chilling here. We are looking fine. We are looking dandy. I'm not too worried. I'm not too worried. Try making that extra read with the top spec. Didn't work out for us. But we are still in this battle. We are still in this battle 100%. I'm feeling fine with it. I'm feeling fine with it. We're going to boost our attack. Get a little bit more bulky with 310 HP. 
And what's he gonna do? Is he gonna outspeed us? No, we are gonna outspeed him. We're gonna set up this drought here. Oh no, he doesn't even get a turn here. But we're gonna set this drought here, which is gonna be fine for us. We go into another fire move later. But the dragon move is gonna give us the what's it called? We're gonna go straight into a dragon move and finish this thing off. Is that what we're gonna do? This thing has, is flying, so I don't think the max wake will affect it. We can go for the flutter buy and uh, lower the target special attack. Hmm. Or we're just going to Max Wormwind and get that stab on him. We're just going to get that stab on him, finish him off if any Pokemon wants to come in here. There you go. See you later, Gyarados. We're chilling here. We're chilling here. Boop. See you later. Okay. We're rocking out now. We're rocking out. I'm not too worried. Like, see him going into his third Pokemon now. Like, definitely see him going into his third Pokemon. That's probably his last resort Pokemon. Let's see who he has. I don't see him going into that Rotom. No way. No way. He goes into Lucario, which we're just going to go straight into a, uh, we go into a Max Quake here. Well, now we're gonna play it safe and just go into a max flare. We have the drought, we have all that good stuff, so we're just gonna go into this max flare, considering it's super effective to this and the road top. And he's not gonna dynamax, he's gonna waste our turns out and probably die. That Lucario should be gone here, unless it's sashed. It is sashed, it is focused sash here, which I'm not too worried about. I'm not too worried about, that's fine, that's fine by me. Close combat's gonna come in here, we'll eat that up. Okay, that's fine. And we should, we do outspeed this thing, we do outspeed this thing. This defense is gonna fall here, he's probably gonna go for a bullet punch or something. And we're going to go straight into another flamethrower. We are scarfed into our flamethrower here. And then we have my scrafty in the back. So I'm not too worried here. I'm not too worried. Let's go. Flamethrower. We should outspeed, right? Unless he goes for a bullet punch. He's going to go for extreme speed. Like I said, he either had bullet punch or extreme speed. A priority move. And a flamethrower is going to pop out here. Beautiful. Do we outspeed that Rotom now is the question. That's the real question. Do we outspeed that Rotom? Because if we do, that's going to be huge for us. That is going to be huge for us. We still have our leftover scrafty in the back end, which is fine. We play this match slow to begin with, but we're looking good now. He still has his Dynamax, though. He still has his Dynamax. He might go into, like, a Leaf Storm or a Max Overgrowth. But he's going to Dynamax here. We're going to go straight into a Flamethrower. Try to do some work on him. Come on. What you want, fool? What you want? Here comes the Dynamax. Trying to save him. This is his last ditch effort here. What are you going to do? What are you going to do, buddy? We have Rest on our, what's it called? On our Scrafty. We still have Rest on our Scrafty. We're chilling. We are chilling. Let's see what this fool wants. Let's see what this fool wants. Let's go. What are you going to do? Do we outspeed? We do outspeed. Get some nice damage off. Take him out. Oh my lord. Are you kidding me? This guy's literally on 1%. 1 HP this guy's sitting at. I thought that was the game. Now my Scrafty needs to eat up a shot. Now my Scrafty needs to eat up a shot here. Wow. Are you kidding me? He's on 1 HP. Like, come on. Do you have Mach Punch? He does not have Mach Punch. Ooh, we. Hmm. We go for a Psychic right off the bat here? Not Psychic, a Rest? Or no, if we eat up, we just have to eat up hit. Our best chance would just be going into an, atta an attack move. I'm trying to get this. We gotta do it. Drain Punch coming out. For the win. For the win. Eat it up, Scrafty. Eat it up, Scrafty. Eat it up, Scrafty. I love you, Scrafty. Let's go. That is the game. Scrafty, you are the best. And he got a crit. Dude, we eat that up, dude. Scrafty's a beast. You better not miss Scrafty. I'll give you one chance here. I'll give you one chance here. Come on, Scrafty. You got this. Thank you, Scrafty. Let's go. GG, baby. That team is awesome, dude. This team is awesome. That Flygon Peck Scrafty combo, that worked out very well for us. I really do like that Flygon on this team. And everyone loves Toxic Peck because he's just always good in singles battles. But let's go. That is how you get it done. Does this guy want it? Does this guy want the L2? We'll hand it to him. This guy's rocking Dragon Ball, T-Tar, Mimikyu, Corver Knight, Exedrill, and that Gyarados. I can see him rolling in maybe with that T-Tar, Exedrill combo. Trying to get that Sand Stream going with Sand Rush, Exedrill, which I believe is the ability on it. But who else are we going to roll here? Who are we going to roll here? I see my Tox Effect being fine here. I see my Tox Effect really chilling and thriving against this team. Because this is a very physical attacking team. Tox Effect is a defensive tank. We might go Tox Effect, Corver Knight, Flygon? Toxapec, Corviknight, Flygon, or do we go Toxapec, Darmanitan, Flygon? I want my Pecs and my Flygon in here for sure. Faux show. Faux show with that choice specs with that Flygon. But I, I say we go double defense tank here. I really do. I say we go double defense tank. We can stall this match out very, very nicely. Let's go. Let's see it. Let's see it again. Let me look at his team one last time before I enter it out. So what does he have that's going to rip up all my Corviknight? It's probably maybe that those rock moves? Maybe those rock moves, but we are Rocky Helmet. We can always roost out. I think we're fine. I think we are chilling here. Let's go. Let's hit done. Let's get one out here. The only thing I wish is that this Corbin Knight 
did have bulk up because bulk up is such a good move or iron defense something along those lines the boost's defense helped him stay alive a little bit longer but it's all good it's all good this thing's rocking body press without any defensive uh buffs which is all right which is all right you know i'd rather have that like i said that bulk up or that iron defense it would help it out a lot but who's gonna lead a t-tar maybe the dragapult the pult of dragons the pultis of dragons that's fine by me. That is fine by me. What you want, fool? What you want? Do we go into that toxic? Do we go into that toxic? What's he gonna do? What are you gonna do? You rocking a lightning move? You rocking a lightning move? Like, the thing is, I don't want to swap out in that. We gotta go for that toxic. This thing's rocking a lightning move, then. We're in some deep trouble. We're in some deep trouble. Let's see. Thunderbolt. He is. We are in some deep trouble here. We eat that up, though. We're chilling. We can go into a recover next turn, which is nice. We get a free toxic off. Because this thing's special attack was poo poo. It was poo poo. It didn't do too much damage. And we're going to get a free recover off on us. Unless he goes into a Dynamax here. Unless he goes into a Dynamax and takes us out, we will get a free recover. But still, that's fine, dude. We get this Toxic on this boy. On the Dragon Ball, which is huge. Which is huge. We're going to rock out into a recover here. We are going to rock out into a nice little recover. We're going to soak up some hits. We're going to heal up with that that was the what i did with remember, remember that that's what tox spec is going to do with the recovery you guys will see in a second <laughs> i can just picture myself looking dumb <laughs> but it's all right it's all right ready t-bolt we'll eat that up no problem no problem we can't get paralyzed either. don't dare tell me it crits okay i was gonna say it doesn't crit we'll get off this free recover right look at this that's what i was talking about <laughs> soaking up into everything and we'll get some nice health back. And we'll get that Black Sludge to go again. And we're just going to stall this out, kind of. He might go for another T-Bolt. We're just going to go for another Recover and go into full health. Or do we read a swap? Or do we read a swap? I could read a swap here. Why oh, read a swap? That'd be hilarious. And go into another Toxic. I'm just going to play it safe by going into another Recover. Let's see. He's going to Dynamax. Try to take out my pecs here. He's going to try to take out my pecs. Which I'm fine with. I am fine with that, man. I'm totally fine with it. Let's see. Can we eat up one shot? Can we eat up one? I'm hoping. I'm hoping we can eat up one. I need this thing out of the way if we're going to do some work. If we're going to do some work, I need this thing out of the way. We need to eat up a Max Lightning. Max Lightning's going to pop here. Can we eat it? Show it to me, Pex. Pex, no! Okay, it's all good. That's one turn down. What are we going to go into now? This is a tough, 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 tough situation. Tough situation because we have that uh, Quiver Knight and that Flygon. Dragon Bolt doesn't work against both, so we need... This dragon pole out the way. We're gonna go into a quarter night, even though it's like he's super effective to both. He's super effective to both. We might just go into a roost. Nice little roost here. And just try to stall out some turns. That's what we gotta do. We just have to stall out some turns right here. And we got that nice little toxic off on this dragon pole, which is huge. And the pressure is on. Pressure is on, baby. It's on. We're just gonna go, like I said, into a roost. Let me see what the fog does again. Hmm. Oh, it blows away screen, so that's nice. That's nice. The fog blows away screens, dude. Let's go. Roos is coming out here. He's going for that max lightning again. This might do some work in that electric terrain. That electric terrain. Let's see. Let's see how we handle this. Max flare. Ooh. Fine by me. It's fine by me. We should eat and we'll get off a nice little roosty poo. Get off a nice little roosty poo. It's all special attacking. It's probably going to take me out next turn. But ready? I'm not too scared here. I'm not too scared right now. I still have my Dynamax with my Flygon in the back end. I am not scared at all. I am not scared at all. Poison is going to take in. He's probably going to take us out this turn. What are we going to do? Or do we dine here? Or do we dine it and go for a max guard? Oh, this is a G max. This is a G max. Okay. Hmm. It's a G max. Now we're not. We're not going to dynamax. We're just going to go for another roost here. But we're probably dead here. I was going to G max there because <laughs> G max is back in this game. He is. They are back in this game. I gotta see his other Pokemon before I choose what I'm choice scarfing or choice backing, but it doesn't matter. I'm going right into my Dynamax. I'm going right into my Dynamax and I'm taking out this uh, Dragon Pole. It is a 1v3 situation here. And watch my Flygon come up huge. Watch how big my Flygon's gonna come up. We're gonna go into a Max Worm when we potentially could outspeed this thing. We could potentially outspeed this thing because we will be Dynamax. And this thing is pretty fast. Flygon's pretty fast. The Dragon Pole, everybody knows how fast the Dragon Pole is. But like I said, we are chilling. I'm not too scared. I'm not too scared. What you want, fool? Max Wormwind's gonna come out here. We're gonna start doing some work on you. We're gonna start doing some work on you, little boy. On you, little boy. What do you want? What you want? Get out my face. Get out my face. Gonna hard swap? What you gonna do, man? It's not gonna hard swap. I'm gonna try to outspeed us here and do a little bit of damage. I'm gonna try to outspeed us and do a little bit of damage. 
Alright, let's go, Flygon. Show it me. Show it to me. Show me that out speed, buddy. I don't think he's gonna have to. But I'm just saying. I'm like, come on, you got this, Flygon. 310 HP. We're chilling. What you want? Get a fly. Get a fly. Get a fly. No, T Bone comes. You stupid or you dumb? Is this guy stupid or is he dumb? <laughs> Guess we're at T Bone and completely, like, doesn't affect us. We're ground. Why wouldn't you just go for a dragon move? Thank you very much, man. Thank you very much. Now we're chilling. We're sitting fine. I, I told you guys we were sitting fine here. We have a very versatile moveset with here. Let's see who else is he going to rock out into. Who are you going to rock out into? I know he has the extra drill. He's probably rocking extra drill T-Tar. Maybe trying to get that Sandstream roll. Let's see. Let's see. That's fine by me if you go into that T-Tar. We have Earth Power and it's Stab. So. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Who are you going to go into, dude? Flygon looks so cool. He just looks so cool. It's just something about him. Ever since he was released in Gen 3, I was like, oh. I was like, no way. This boy's sick. I gotta have him on my team. Even though he's kind of outshadowed by that Salamance. But still, he's still sick. Here goes that Corbo. Mm -hmm. I'm fine by that. We're going into a next player here. With that Drought, that should be able to do some work. Let's get it. Let's get it. Whoever's gonna pop out there. We should be able to do some mean work on him. We do outspeed. This thing is a defense tank. And this is a special attack and move. Bill, see you later. See you later. We're still here. We're still here. Like I said, I'm not worried. I told you guys, I'm not worried. After that, what what was our second Pokemon that went out? Our Corbinite? I told you. I was like, dude, we still have our Flygon in the back end. It's an absolute unit. I'm not worried here. I'm not worried. Who's your last Pokemon? Extra Joe, bro, dude. Get out of my face, dude. Mold Breaker. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get it. We're going to rock right into yet another Max Quake. Or are we going to go into a Max Quake? We're going to go into a Max Quake. Mm, what's going to do more? The Stab Max Quake? Or the... The max flare. That's tough. That's tough. I mean, this has a uh, same base power. That's tough. In a drought, or I think drought boost is like 33, and this is 1.5. I think it's 1.33 times with the drought, and I think it's 1.5 with stab. So we're gonna go with our stab move. Let's see. We're gonna outspeed. We get this max quick off. Is he sashed? Is he sashed, or do we get this win? What is it? What is it? He's sashed. He's sashed. So all we gotta do is eat up one hit here. We just have to eat up one hit here. Let's go. Let's go. Eat it up, Flygon. What is he going to go into that's going to beat us? We're going to boost our special defense, which is fine. EQ is going to pop out here. That's fine. Wait, are we rocking Levitate? I'm a little confused how that EQ hit us. Is it because we're Dynamax? I'm pretty sure we're Levitate on this. Oh, he has Mold Breaker. He has Mold Breaker. That's fine by us. And we're going to get this win. That's going to be GG. Game over. We're just going to go into a nice little uh, Earth Power. We're just going to go into an Earth Power and finish this game off. Let's get it, guys. GG. This battle is probably canceled. Come on. Show it to me. Show it to me. You're not killing me. Unless we miss. And maybe you get a crit. Battle was canceled. Let's get it, guys. That is how it's done. Let's hop into one more battle. I'm going to give you guys three battles for this video. Flygon just rocked it out for us once again. He is so good. This guy's rocking Cinderance, Toxtricity, Dreadnought. How do you say this guy? Configurus? Is that how you pronounce it? I think it is. Corviknight and Butterfree. We're going to be bringing in... We bring in our pecs again. I'm scared he's going to be bringing in his boy right here. His, uh... Toxtricity, but I'd say we go Pex Flygon again. But if he goes in with that Toxtricity, then we can always swap out into Flygon. And then maybe we bring our own Toxtricity here. Maybe we bring our own Toxtricity along with us. That could be good. That could be good. We could go Pex Flygon Toxtricity. Because Toxtricity can do some work against a lot of these Pokemon. So let's roll out. Let's roll out. Let's get in there, Pex. Get in there, Toxtricity. And Flygon in the back end. I'm just going to be using Flygon in order to swap out here. Because I think he's going to try to lead that Toxtricity. I think that's what he might do. He might try to lead that Toxtricity or that Configurus. And if he leads that Configurus, maybe we can just get a Toxic off. But if he goes into that Toxtricity, we're just going to swap it to a Flygon, eat up an Electric Shot. It's all good. It won't affect us at all because we are part ground, which is beautiful about Flygon. That is the best part about Flygon. See, there it is. Toxtricity comes out here. So we're chilling. We're chilling. Does he see us swapping out? Does he see us swapping out? Or I think he's going to go for an Electric move here. I think he's going to go for an Electric move. We're just going to rock out into our Flygon here. And we go stab Earth Power. Which is fine. Which is fine by us. Stab Earth Power will one-tap this thing up. Let's see. Pex come back. Get it, Pex. Get it, Pex. And here comes probably his uh, Discharge or his T-Bolt. Let's see what's going to come in here. Nussle's going to come in here. Try to paralyze us. That's fine. That's fine. And we're just going to rock out into a Earth Power. Let's go. Let's get it. Earth Power's going to pop out here. We're going to stab it up. We're going to stab it up. Let's see if he stays in. We should outspeed this thing. Yo, did you see Toxtricity's tongue? He's like, no. <laughs> It's so funny. Like, what is Toxtricity? Is he like a Salamander and a Reptile or something? But he stays in. He stays in. We can say bye-bye to him. See you later, Toxtricity. See you later, Stab. Earth Power right there. Night-night. Like I said, dude, that would have one-tapped him. And it did. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. 
Nice little start for us. Nice little start for us. So you do, yeah, we are learning. We are making reads, making better plays, dude. I'm feeling so much better as a Pokemon player now. As I've been playing for like a solid month now. Just been on it. Just been on the grind, dude. I love it so much. And I love making the reads and everything. I can just see myself get, getting better and better every single day. Which is dope. Which is dope. But what is this guy going to rock out to, into? The Corvo. The Corvo. I might just dynam Dynamax and try to put this thing in this place. But we can't swap out into the uh, Hour Toxtricity. Uh, let me see his team, first of all. We could go into the Flamethrower. But we I don't want a Dynamax. We are choice into the... Uh, what's it called right now? That Earth Power, which does nothing against him. It has no effect. So we're probably going to swap out here. Let's go into... Let's check out his Pokemon. Before we even go. So his Toxtricity is gone. He has the Corvo, right? And what else do I see him rolling out here? Maybe that Butterfree? Maybe that Butterfree. We could go back into our pecs here. And try to get that Toxic off. I think that's exactly what we we're going to do. I'm going to roll out into our pecs here. Because Pex is a defense tank. If he goes for a Brave Bird or something, we'll eat it up, no problem. We can go into a Recover, stall a little bit more, and get that Toxic off. That is our plan. Or we can potentially Scald out and get a Burn. Let's see what he goes for. Steel Wing's going to pop out here. We'll eat that up. Look at that. Look at that. Dude, nice little read by me. Go into my Pex. Black Sludge is going to heal us up basically to the top. 155. We're 2 HP off. And then we're just going to rock out into a Toxic here. And play it slow. Play it slow. Let's roll. Let's roll. Is he going to die in here? I can see him maybe Dynamaxing for his last ditch effort here. Let's see. Home Claw is going to come in here. That's fine by me. That is fine by me. Raise your attack. Go ahead. Raise it, dude. Raise your attack. That's fine. And your accuracy. Toxic's coming out here on you. It doesn't affect Corvo. Dang, dude. I forgot about that. I forgot about that. That's nuts. That's nuts. But we're just going to go for Scalds then. Try to get a burn off him because we can just slow this up. We can just slow this game up. Dang, dude. I forgot that the what's it called? That the Toxic doesn't go on the Corvo. It always serves well because I just see him as a burn Pokemon. Not with that Seal type. Home Claw is going to pop out here again. I still see he's eating up a lot of his shots here. I still see him see us eat up a lot of his shots, even though his act or his attacks plus two. We get this burn. Show me the Bernie Sanders here. Show it to me. Let's go, Bernie Sanders. Let's get it, guys. <laughs> I love calling it Bernie Sanders. Dude. It's just too funny, man. You just cannot not call it that. And then we're just gonna go into another scald here. Um, I'm thinking we should have recovered here. He's probably gonna go into an attack with or Dynamaxing. That's fine. We got that burn, man. We got that burn. Feel the burn, baby. Let's go. Power trip's gonna come out here. Ooh, okay. Okay, we eat that up, dude. <laughs> Scald. Mwah. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. He might go into Roost, but we're just going to keep burning out here. Do we think he's going into Roost? Because if he's going into Roost, I'm going to hard swap out. If we think he's going into a Roost, I might hard swap out. With that, we can go into an Overdrive and just mark on him. Let's do it. Let's do it. I say he goes for a Roost. Here. I say he goes for a Roost. And we're going to get a free swap in. I'm making a read. I'm making a read. I could stay in with my with my Tox Specs, but I'm going to I'm gonna try to do this. I'm trying to make reads here, guys. Let's see. Tox Specs is going to come back. We're going to go into our Toxtricity. And what is this guy going to go for? What is he going to go for? Because I know we'll probably outspeed that thing. He's going for that Roost. He's going for that Dynamax. He's going for that Dynamax. Wow. Okay. Okay, I was not expecting that considering he's burn and blow half, but I think this is his last ditch effort here. I think his last Pokemon cannot handle my pecs or my Flygon. Let's see, what is he going to go into? Is this G Max? Is this G Max? This might be G Max. Let's see. He's going to go into a Max Darkness. Can we eat? Show it to me. Tox. Tox eats, dude. All day, buddy. All day, Tox eats. What's that going to lower? Let's go into lower my defense set, my special defense, which is fine. This thing's physical attacking. Yo, Burn's gonna pop off here, and we're, we might be able to out outspeed here. Let's see. Let's go into an overdrive and potentially take him out. Potentially take him out. I can see us outspeeding. Yeah, we do outspeed. See you later, Corvo. Bye-bye, buddy. Let's go, dude. We're gonna have a nice little 3-0 here, I think. We're gonna have a 3-0 because we can swap out into our packs or our flying out. Yo, we are chilling. Looking good, yo. Playing these games, awesome, dude. We're crushing it out here. We are crushing it out here. What does this fool What? Who's his last Pokemon? Who's his last Pokemon? I'm gonna say it's the Butterfree. No way, he would have led with that Butterfree. Here it is. Oh, it's not Configurus. It's Runarigus. That's what it is. Runarigus. And we are not very effective to anything here. But I might still try to get this uh, poison off on him. I might still just try to get this poison off. Considering this thing does nothing. You can see what he's going to do here. Sludge Wave is going to come off here. He's just going to try to get that nice little poison off on him. Come on, show it to me. Give it to him. Give it to him. Let's go, baby. Let's go. That we get it. That's what we do. Curse is going to pop out here. He's gonna oh there's the little nail through his skull. He's poisoned now and he's gonna put a curse on us. It's kinda dumb. That's kinda dumb. You're kinda done now. Kinda done. He's gonna leave that match. It's GG, baby. That is GG unless this thing's rocking like a heal move. 
There goes our nail through our head. Mwah. This thing rocking a berry. I can see it rocking a berry, maybe. Nope, no berry. We're just gonna sludge wave out here. Sludge wave should be able to take it out with that poison. I think sludge wave will bring it down the red, or is he gonna cancel the battle out? Let's see. Nope, he's not gonna cancel out. He's staying in. He said he wants more. He says he wants that L. Can that poison take him out? Can that poison take him out? He's gonna go for a will o wisp. Dude, what? Like, what are you doing, buddy? I think he just knows the game's over. He's just rocking out into like, yo, here, have a burn at the end. Nah, man, yo. Poison, take him out. Come on, show it to me, baby. Yes, let's go, dude. GG, baby. That is how you rock out with this team. Let's get it, dude. We just rocked out 3 0 with this team. Are you kidding me? Are you serious, dude? I've been rocking out lately. That was hype. Let's get it, guys. That is how it's done. Rocked out with this flag on team right here. Got three wins, dominated actually, played very, very well. I actually see myself getting a lot better at this game, so I'm hype. I'm starting to see myself make plays that I never used to make before and make reads that I never used to make before. So it is hype, it is hype. But guys, if you'd like to use this team for yourself, round the code is at the bottom of the screen. Also guys, let me know for question of the day in the comment section down below, what games are you most excited for that have not came out yet? Seriously guys, I cannot wait for Animal Crossing. I'm gonna be doing some content on this channel. So you guys better be here, I better see you guys. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, make sure you show up by smashing that like button, clicking that subscribe button, and let me know in the comment section down below. Seriously, the support on these videos has been amazing. Cannot thank you guys enough. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.